So if I think back to the first 24 hours and when the pandemic really hit, uh, obviously it was quite unsettling. It was a lot of movements. It was a lot of coordination of people, their belongings, where were they going to go? Uh, but along with all of that and the kind of scariness of it, it was actually exciting to say to people that had been sleeping on camp beds in a shared room, you're going to get your own bedroom and you're going to be able to have an ensuite bathroom and you know, you're going to have food delivered, which we didn't have at Floyd's Row. And I, I think people were scared but excited at the same time. And we didn't know how long it was going to go on for. Um, so there were lots of staff and residents sort of running around, packing up bags, ordering taxis. Um, and I don't think we could have moved out as quickly as we did without the support of the residents, packing away camp beds, helping kind of tidy up. And by the end of the day, we were all in the travel lodge and that was kind of our new home for the foreseeable. We didn't know when it was going to end at that point.